We're just going to have a look at some of the um, common errors in Python programming with Pygame. So this example here, uh, the user is getting a black screen coming up rather than white with their images um, loaded onto the screen. So when we run the program, uh, we just get uh, an error and we get a black screen. So when you get an error, uh, it doesn't necessarily point you in the right direction. So it says here, uh, failure to load, couldn't open wheel.ping. So it doesn't really tell us much. We've got wheel.ping in there, we've defined it. That's not the error, it's actually masking something else. So let's have a look at our program and see if we can figure out what's going on. So we've initialized, initialized Pygame there, that's fine. We've got our display right, we've got, um, we defined white and we defined black, that's very important. So we've defined white with the correct values, that's all good. Uh, down the bottom, if you have looked in the bottom, um, you must have pygame.display.update, that must be there, and of course, game display dot fill dot white that must be there okay and then you got you quit there as well so what the problem normally is with this error is that you've done something wrong with your while loop so what you need to have is your while statement uh, with no indentation right against there your for should um, automatically be indented once you put the colon there. Okay, that's all good. This is all good. Now what the problem is here is that the if needs to be indented as well. So what the program is reading is when while is running it'll run these three lines uh, here and that'll be okay and then it says okay here you're starting a, a separate little subroutine or sub program that doesn't fall under while. Okay, it starts its own little uh, decision or conditional statement. That's not right. You need to have, once we start while, you need to have the if statements all indented. So these are all good, these are all indented. Okay, but that one needs to be indented as well. So that's what's throwing it out. Throwing it out. Once you start a new uh, sub uh, subroutine, um, these things here, these images, these wheel images, I'll say, well, I haven't got any context to uh, source those images because um, I've just started from here rather than from up here. Okay, so all you have to do here is just indent that if statement. So just press tab. Okay, now that's brought it up even with that, which you don't really want. So just tap that one in one space like that. Okay, and now it should be should be right to go. So if you press save, just control S, and you run the module, hopefully it should come up with the white screen. So we've got our um, a wheel there, we've got our arrow images come up okay, it's all white and no errors down here. So hopefully that will help you with the black screen error.